Welcome back everybody to the road show this morning in the buzz brought to you by the comedy connection so researchers are predicting a positive trend in global life expectancy this is good mm -hmm. a study published in the medical journal uh, the Lancet finds global life expectancy could rise by up to five years for men and four years for women in the next 30 years that's right so researchers say recent public health measures to prevent and treat heart disease and COVID-19 are among factors for the life expectancy to actually increase. So the study also finds chronic ailments will be more significant threat to life expectancy than infectious diseases in the future. Now researchers say the study shows the importance of getting ahead of metabolic and dietary risk factors such as high blood pressure and high body mass index. So the sad is thinking about how we stay young in our everyday lives. I hear people sometimes say, oh, I don't want to live to be that old. And I'm like, why would you not want right, to live to be that old? I want, if somebody said to me, you could live to be 100 and something, I'm, I'm in. Sign me up. As long as I know, like as long as I have my own like faculty and I know what's going on. Yes. And something, someone's not have, going to have to really take care of me too much. Right. You'd then be okay I, then I'm that. okay with that. Yeah. My father lived to be 91 and was active up until the last second. My mother was lived to be 87, was raking the yards and out in her yard up until that time, was active the whole time. So you've got some good genes. So there. I hope that's, so. That's a good so factor I hope so. on your that's, side. That's all pluses. Absolutely. We were saying this morning too, staying active and healthy. Those are like seem to be the big factors. Right. When we think of everybody in our lives, like you were just saying your parents, uh, my, my grandmother's the same way. I mean, my grandmother is still doing the stationary bike up until her 80s in her in her apartment and that probably kept her that way I mean she lived to be in her 90s yes so I do feel like there is something to be said for you know eating well taking care of yourself and I also think being happy you right. know if you're like you know a happy person you're doing things that you know bring you joy yep. I can't see that being a bad thing right right but remember <laughs> when we were all younger when you were younger and you'd hear someone who was was in like their their late 30s or 40s or 50s and you're like whoa that's old. No, I don't remember. No, you do okay. remember. But, but you do remember that. Like you'd hear somebody's in their fifties, and when you're a young, when you're a kid, you think, "Whoa, fifties old." I then do. you get to fifty. I trust do. me. You get to 50 and you're like, okay, that's not old. Well, my dad had me when I was, when he was 30. Right. So we've always just been. So when I was 10, we had a 40, 40, you know, over the hill. Remember right. Used to have that yeah, big yeah. Thing? They don't do that anymore so much. But I remember thinking he's so old. Mm -hmm. He's over the hill. Right. So I'm a little bit more over the hill. Right. My father was, I think, 51 when I was born. Oh. 51. I can't even imagine being 51 and especially, having a brain. Especially, you know, at that, at at, that stage. At back absolutely. in like the, the, yeah. the late that's, 60s, that's early more, 70s. Now I feel like that's a little bit more, you know, right. on the rise. But you also see a lot of older, you know, people who are in their 80s and 90s, and they are not 80 and 90 year old people. No, they don't they're look active, it. They're active, they're out there mm -hmm. vacationing, they're driving, they're out shopping, they're taking classes, and I, I love that. I do too. I love that. I hope I can be like that. It's our, that's our goal. It is my, it is my that's goal. That's what we need to do. That's stay my active, goal. Yes. stay healthy. Stay active. Active Do and healthy and get ready. <laughs> Brendan? What are you doing? Well, you, well, see, this is where I just have to laugh because you know I, I walk. That's right. like my exercise, yeah, and it really is quite fulfilling. And it's relaxing, and it's a good mental refresh. Mm -hmm. There's so many benefits to walking, and I can't help but laugh because my grandmother used to walk. Right. That was her thing around the neighborhood, <laughs> and my grandfather would refer to it as <laughs> foot patrol. Yes, you know, like she oh, yes. Like, <laughs> just don't know. Why. I agree with that. And we would laugh at it. Now I'm foot patrol. Mm -hmm. Like think he wouldn't be. You know, it's like I'm just because these are good things to do. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. you can laugh a little bit, but I think it's just staying active, taking on new hobbies. You guys know. I mean, I started the guitar in my later 30s, yes. and it's never really too late to pick up something to keep you fresh. Right. I think sure. that's what it's all about Stay and I remember fresh. Sim similarly to you Audrey I remember when my dad turned 40 I thought oh dad right. is 40 he's old right <laughs> but now, it's, now so old. it's like it's like you're a baby exactly like, oh, you're just a baby yeah but I think it's all a mental frame of mind you know stay active keep moving and do what makes you happy well mm -hmm. do your kids think of you as old uh, as long as I'm paying the bills, probably not. <laughs> Dad, you look so young. As long as I'm paying the bills, probably not. But I, I don't think my kids. I, I, I don't, don't know think if so. they think of me as old. I don't think so. Probably do. I don't uh, know. Yeah. Here comes my big turnaround. You ready, guys? There it is. Let's check in with our viewers. I know. That was a move. So a talented, one. right? You know, you're Ooh, young and active. You That's why. He went like that. Yes. <laughs> Rhonda's up first. I love this. I keep working instead of retiring and surround myself with young people. I have no choice since I'm the oldest at my company. 
of over 60 people, and I'm a firm believer in good vitamins. Oh, that's a good right. tip. Yes. That's a good tip. Nathan adds, during the warmer half of the year, I try to keep a body weight oriented exercise schedule and go on hikes in forest and or beach areas. I don't know if that keeps me young, but it's more about getting fit if you can stay mm -hmm. in shape, right? Dennis adds, what keeps him young, the grandkiddos keep you young, and also, as we know, Dennis loves his good Polish food right there. <laughs> <laughs> and, yeah, the kielbasa is the gateway oh, to the so good. Yeah. <laughs> Marsha closes things out today with, my husband and my friends help to keep me young. We go out, listen to local bands, and just have a good time. It must be working because many people are surprised when I tell them how old I am, and she adds a parenthetical citation 65 wow. you know what Marsha you're just getting started it's all about how you feel I love that thanks for chiming in everyone please keep those comments coming you never know I might go like this and it could be your comment what could be more exciting Whoa. I know follow us at the roadshow thank you for playing along Facebook X and Instagram we'd love to hear from you